Welcome guys to another video here with Leo Photo TV. My name is Frank. I'm a full-time photographer and videographer. I am speaking here in behalf of Leo Photo. Guys, today we're going to be showing a brand new product from Leo Photo that they release for the people specifically doing video work. Today we're going to be taking a look at the MP-320C C monopod together with the DV-02 legs that converts the monopod into a video monopod. Let's take a look at this new product here on Leo Photo TV. As all we know, Leo Photo have been building amazing monopods, but they have been geared specifically or designed specifically for photography work. This is the very first time where they combine two of their product, a monopod and a feed, to be a monopod for video work or a video monopod like we call it. They are using the MP-36C monopod together with the new DV-02 feeds so you can combine these two things now and have an amazing monopod for video work okay taking a look here at the things that comes with the monopod and the feet first is the bag this is a regular bag like any other product that leo photo sells it's a really good quality bag they use ykk zipper which is really good and it also comes with the two uh, with a couple of these little kits that Leo Photo includes with almost all of their products. Now, the monopod itself is this little thing. This is the MP-326C monopod. As you see, it is very tiny. It is also lightweight. It's less than half a kilogram. It shares the same components with their brother in the tripod range from Leo Photo. For example, it shares the same 10 layers carbon fiber legs. Also shares all of the rubberized material and the new shim system for the legs. Also, they have divided this kind of uh, monopod from the regular uh, monopod for photography because this is intended specifically to work for video people. And here what we have is this handle here. This grip is different than in the other uh, monopods, like for example, on the detachable legs that come with the uh, LT series uh, tripod of uh, Leo Photo product, because they know that you're gonna be grabbing this and you're gonna be sweating, and this is absorbing that and giving you a very grip. They also uh, add this little latch. This here is for you to put your hand on it and grab into your monopod. If you let it go for any reason, your equipment is not going to be flying away or it's not, gonna, it's not gonna get damaged coming into the floor. Now, another thing that they have done is that they put this monopod to be a six section monopod. Basically, you have a fixed section and then you have five other sections. Like with any monopod or tripod from your photo, opening and closing the legs is a matter of second because of the quick twist lock system mechanism that they are using here. The top part, the base, is very wide. So you can put even a bigger video head instead of just using a regular two-way monopod head. But they're also including something that they put on their LLS line of tripod, which is the double screw in here. Here they combine a 3A screw together with a quarter 20 screw on the center, which I love that feature. And here at the bottom, they are also including the removable feet. And this is very important because this is where you're going to be putting your legs that I'm going to show you right now. And those legs or those feet, like they call it, is the new DV-02. It's this little thing. Let me put this aside here. These are the new feet that will convert this monopod into a full future video monopod. As tiny as it is, it's very stable because for you to open it, you just turn it around and open the feet. 
this gives you a really stable base for you to work for your video uh, production or for your video work. For example, if you are in a situation where you need to be portable, where you need to be quick in what you're doing, a tripod might work, but it's always sometimes getting on the way the three legs. So with a monopod and these three little feet will allow you for you to get really stable shots, but at the same time, be quick and be nimble. One of the most important thing of this tripod is that of these tripod legs, of this monopod leg, I should say, is that include a monopod or a ball head here at the center. If I lose this drag control knob here, as you see, we got a ball. Basically what they have done is that they took one of their balls from one of their ball heads and they put it in here. They add the traction and friction control at the bottom but also they put control on the angle that you can use. For example, if I tie this knob here at the bottom, hope you can see it, now I don't have movement at all. If I lose it here, I have a lot of movement. I got about 30 degrees on each side of this ball head for me to work. That gives you a lot of flexibility because if you are working on uneven terrain, I am sure that you will find the perfect angle for your steady shot. First, traction control. If you want to lose or you want to tighter, that depends on you, but you can tighten in here. And how much angle you want is controlled by this rep knob. This is a great thing because in some cases, you want to make sure that you have that possibility of adding a couple of different angles, like a Dutch angle or something like that, but you don't want to pass on certain specific angle. This will allow you to do. Me specifically, I leave it all the time up. I have a lot of control, but what I do is that I, uh, I add a little bit of pressure or a little bit of tension. So when I'm moving my monopod, I know what I'm doing because I can feel the drag and the resistance on my monopod. Because of this monopod, the MP-326 seat uh, holds so much. This tripod offers you a 20 kilogram payload capacity. You can even put here an Alexa camera. I mean, it's amazing how robust this tripod is. Now the feet doesn't hold that. It holds up to 10 kilograms, which is really good also. But you are sure that you can put in here a full size body or an extra size battery camera with a 70 to 200 and you're not gonna have problem at all. How do you combine these two things? Very simple. Here on the tripod, you take this leg, this uh, feet, this is the regular feet that comes with every of the monopod and tripod from Leo Photo. We put that aside. And as you see, we have the same uh, 3 8 space here. And now you just screw this in and you just twist it. There you go. And now what you have is a video monopod. And as you see, I have the tension control all loose and I have a lot of angle for me to play with. If I have, for example, a little bit of resistance added to it, and I got this up, I got more friction to it. If I tighten it even more, I basically have to fight it for me to be able to move it. Of course, the heavier the camera you put on the top, the more tension you should add to your monopod resist resisting uh, system down here, or tension system, so you will have more control. One good thing about this tripod or this monopod fit is that this uh, leveling system, if you go down, completely down the here, and you tie this knob, you can leave this monopod by itself and it will not trip. So you have to be careful there. You're not gonna put a 70 to 200 in front of the camera and you're gonna leave it just like that. You, f you balance your camera with your quick release plate on your monopod or video head mounted in here and then you make sure that wherever the weight is going you put one of the feet to the same direction because that's going to ensure that your equipment is going to be safe very small very lightweight really robust now how do you close these legs very simple let me put it this way i hope that you can see it here 
these red knobs here, you just press it and you twist it and that's it. Very simple, very useful. This, guys, is a really, really good option if you're doing photography and also videography at the same time. So guys, this was a quick overview of this new kit. This is combining the uh, MP-320C monopod with the DV-02 legs from Leo Photo. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching Leo Photo TV. My name is Frank. I hope that you subscribe to our channel. Until next time, see you later.